gonna be so ah. Uh, this is gonna be hard. This is gonna be like really, really, really hard. Hello and welcome back to Art of the Meal. My name is Chloe Rose and I'm a full-time artist and YouTuber. Now, if you've not seen one of these episodes before, I'll give you a brief rundown. Now, Thrillist here will send me a mystery box of food items. I don't know what's inside, but every single episode I unbox it, take it out, look at the prompt word, and I have to make something creative out of it. It's very nerve-wracking every single time, but you know what? It's a lot of fun, and I hope that you enjoy this new adventure. New adventure? What the heck was that? No. It's a giant, very, very heavy boy this week. I don't know what they've got in here. So, we're gonna open it up and see what's inside. Okay, we have... Okay, we have some, oh my gosh, we've got M&M's. Is this filled with M&M's? Because all I'm seeing right now are M&M's. Okay, let's, let's, I'm gonna, I'm getting ahead of myself. Let's read the prompt word. It says, Chloe, another challenge down, nice work. This week, we are going to give you just one day to make a new piece of work. You must use whatever you find inside this box, but you are allowed to use outside materials to help you make your final work. This week, your theme is <laughs> M&M. Best of luck, Thrillist. Um, this is, this is, I don't really have a clue about Eminem or any of that stuff. <laughs> I personally don't listen to rap music at all, so I know of Eminem, and I'm a bit nervous that this is just all going to be Eminem's, and I'm going to have to make Eminem with Eminem's. <laughs> So the first bag of M&M's we have are these milk chocolate Cupid's mix. We have some M&M's minis, pecan pie milk chocolate. Ooh, that doesn't sound very good. <laughs> White pumpkin pie. <gasps> oh, this is, okay. I love peanut M&M's, they're my favorite. Oh my gosh, this is, look at the size of this. This is a lot of M&M's, people. I don't, I don't know what I'm gonna do. Hazelnut spread. Just more regular white candy corn m and M. Okay, that is it. I've made a giant mess, but I've got all of my M&Ms. I'm very excited. So I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna sketch out a picture of his face and then try and use the M&Ms to make like a bit of a mural. It's gonna be tough. I'm gonna have to separate the M&Ms, but I'm very excited. Um, wish me luck though, because I'm gonna need it. Ah, this is gonna be such a messy experiment. I'm thinking M&M is going to be a bit pink and orange in this. The vibe I'm going to go for. There we go. There is his eyeball. <laughs> this is going to be really difficult. Mm, I don't know what to do. just broken apart in my hand. <laughs> oh no, it's melted! So, first task is to not hold on to the M&Ms because they will melt into your hand. Oh yeah, this is this is looking good. This is looking good. Even from a distance, it doesn't look good. I was being very meticulous about this at the start, but now, honestly, I'm just trying, I'm just throwing them anywhere. So, we're just gonna see what happens. That is not looking very good. From this angle, I cannot for the life of me tell what I'm actually doing. This is how it looks for me. Um, it's just a giant array of M&Ms and it's really difficult to differentiate what's what. So it's not the best, but you know, you gotta do what you gotta do. I'm trying to take a photo of it to see from a distance if it looks... <laughs> it looks so bad! He doesn't really look like m and M. He looks more like Elon Musk to me, uh, but I'm trying. His other eye isn't done, neither is the other half of his face and his chin. So hopefully that'll help him look more like Eminem. It doesn't look like an ear, but that, that'll do as it is. <laughs> Yeah. 
you know what? I'm gonna call it done because I don't know what else to do to fix it. I would rate this for difficulty probably a 50,000 out of 10. I would rate my actual portrait as maybe a four out of 10 for accuracy. I will give myself like a six out of 10 for the fact I actually did make it look somewhat like a face, but proportionate wise, it's just not right. It's literally like a funny looking Elon Musk clone with like a, a shaved head. That's the best way I can describe this. So for now, I am gonna call this done. Uh, so thank you very much for watching. I really hope that you enjoyed. I tried my best. <laughs> it's dark outside, it's like 10 p.m. Is it 10 p.m.? I could be wrong. My computer is dead. Let us know in the comments down below what food items you'd like to see me make creative stuff out of next time. Take care of yourselves and we will see you in the next Art of the Meal.